This is an ABC 10 News update. Good evening, I'm Kimberly Hunt in the ABC 10 News studio. The San Diego Padres bolster their roster ahead of Major League Baseball's trade deadline. They acquired Washington National superstar Juan Soto in a multiplayer blockbuster deal. The trade sends Soto and first baseman Josh Bell to San Diego for a package of Padre prospects, including C.J. Abrams and outfielders Robert Hassel and James Wood. Meantime, the Padres will say goodbye to first baseman Eric Hosmer. ESPN reports he rejected the trade to the Washington Nationals as part of the Soto deal, and now he'll head to Boston Red Sox. Well, the Padres confirmed that Tuesday afternoon. Hosmer played for the Padres for five years. ESPN reports the Padres will pay a large portion of his remaining salary for the next three seasons. That's about $44 million. The Padres acquired left-handed pitcher Jay Groom as part of the deal to trade Hosmer. The San Diego International Airport is getting closer to pre-pandemic trends. It served more than 2 million passengers in June. This marks the first time the airport has had that many passengers since December of 2019. The airport says the increase in passengers is partly attributed to more nonstop domestic and international flights. This all comes as people continue to navigate delays while Terminal 1 is under construction. The new terminal should be complete by 2025. Weathercaster Vanessa Paz is joining us now to tell us how this heat and humidity will stick around for a while or when we can expect it to leave, Vanessa. Right, another warm and muggy day and thunderstorm activity significantly has weakened within the past 12 hours or so. Here's a quick look at tomorrow's highs, 70s for the beaches, 80s inland.